sing God, amazing God, in all affliction, Lord, my hope in you has never failed, for all my troubles I have found there is no trust in man and how can I repay the Lord for all his gifts to me by offering him the salvation and calling on his name. His people witness how I keep my promises to God. Lord, let me live and die in hope of following your way. In all my affliction, my hope is built. For all my troubles I have found, there is no trust in man. Good afternoon, my dear brothers and sisters. I'm Reverend Father Mario David Ibe, the spiritual director of the Lumen Christi Family Adoration Ministry, Catholic Dows of Iseluku, and the coordinator of the Morning Dew Devotion, MDD Square. This day is a special day the first day of the month of August, the year 2022, the year of the Lord. Today, the Lord has been gracious to us. The Lord has been good to us. The Lord has shown us his mercy. And we are privileged to see yet a new month. So, this afternoon, we have gathered around the altar where the Eucharistic Jesus has been enthroned as the God of the universe. Child of God, I just want you this afternoon to begin to drop your intentions. There are many things bothering you. There are many things weighing you down. I just want you to begin to drop your intentions before the King of Kings, before the Lord of Lords, because before the Alpha and the Omega. Be you a Catholic, be you a Pentecostal, be you a Muslim, if you are connected at this hour, your creator has done it so. And there is a reason for this divine connection. So at this hour, I want you to begin to present your intentions to Jesus. We cannot continue to keep quiet. The word of God says, ask and you shall receive. Seek and you shall find. Knock and the door shall be opened unto you. Child of God, you are being given the opportunity to seek. You are being given the opportunity to knock. You are being given the opportunity to ask God for his blessings. And I tell you solemnly, our God is ready to bless you. His name is Jesus. He is the bread of life. Hear what the word of God says. Hear what the word of God says. Happy are those who hear the joyful call to worship. <laughs> for there we walk in the light of your presence, O Lord. You have been called to worship God at this hour. Say something to him. Present your intentions. Tell him, Lord, I worship you. Lord, I bow down before you. Lord, you are the king of kings. There is no one like you. There is no one beside you. You are the savior of those who seek refuge in you. You are the giver of strength. You are the savior of the world. You are mighty in power, mighty in strength. You are the father and ruler of our lives. You are the protector. You are the rock of ages. You are the help of Christians. 
you are a stronghold in times of struggle, in times of pain, in times of afflictions. We come to you this afternoon, Lord, begging you to make this month a special month for us. Child of God, this is a month of a new beginning. It is your month for a new beginning. And I want to believe that you are drawing strength from Jesus, the bread of life, for a new beginning. It is your month of a new beginning. Blessed be the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Blessed be the King of kings and the Lord of lords, the Alpha and the Omega, the beginning and the end. He is the God who is ever ready to bless you. He is the God who is ever ready to change your situation. Begin to drop your petitions and believe in Jesus Christ. The word of God says, great indeed are the words of God. Great indeed are the words of God. And I tell you, you are wonderfully made. Present yourself to the King of Kings. Present yourself to the Lord of Lords. Tell God, I surrender my life to you. I surrender all to you. I surrender my family. I surrender my business. I surrender my children. I surrender my husband. This afternoon. Child of God, it is time for you to connect to grace. Draw strength from Jesus. Draw strength from Jesus now. The journey of August 2022. Draw strength from the bread of life. Wherever you are hearing the sound of my voice, behold Jesus Christ. Draw strength from him. Draw strength from Jesus this afternoon. Begin to draw strength from him now. As you gaze... As you look at him, the Lord is walking in you. The Lord is empowering you. The Lord is changing your life. The Lord is changing your situations. The Lord is walking out a way for you. Behold him. God is walking for somebody now. I'm going to sing a song. And the song describes what God is doing now for you. Present yourself, say, Lord, my hope is in you. I trust in you. Glorify your name, Jesus. Strengthen me for this month. I need your strength. It is a month of a new beginning. Seven is the number of perfection. Eight is the number for a new beginning. So today, you are beginning a new life. I'm telling you the truth. This song says, Great indeed are your words, O Lord, now and evermore. Somebody said, the Lord is walking in me. Great indeed are your words, O Lord, now and evermore. The Lord is working in you. The universe, night and day, tells all your wonders. You are our light and our life. We shall praise you always, always. Great indeed are your words, O Lord, now and evermore. Oh, Jesus. Great indeed are your words, O Lord, now and evermore. You are the part which we tread. You will lead us onward. From every corner of the earth. All the nations gather. Gather. Great indeed are your words, O Lord. Now and evermore. Great indeed are your words, O Lord. 
now and evermore. You lead them all by the land of your heavenly kingdom. Then at the end of all times, you will come in glory, glory, great indeed are your words, O Lord, now and evermore. Great indeed are your words, O Lord, now and evermore. Father in heaven, I thank you. The word of the Lord says in Exodus chapter 4, verse 12, Now go, I will help you speak. And we teach you what to say. Child of God, I pray for you in this new month. That God will direct your movement. That God will direct your steps. That God will direct your movement from today to the end of this month and forevermore. Amen. You will not miss your way. You will not miss your track. Since it is a month of a new beginning. May God direct your step. Is somebody saying amen? Somebody say, Lord, direct my step in this new month. Direct my step. Direct my step. Oh God, direct my step in this new month. Direct my step, oh God. I commit my life into your hands. Hear this. Hear what the Bible says in Isaiah chapter 30 verse 21. The word of God says, whether you turn to the right or to the left, your ears will hear a voice behind you saying, this is the way. Walk in it. Child of God, I prophesy and I pray that by the grace of God, you will not miss your road this month. The devil will not succeed to make you miss your road this month. Your children will not miss their road. You will not miss your road. By the power in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, the King of kings and the Lord of lords and the Alpha and the Omega, the Lord will direct you. The Lord will direct your movement. The Lord will direct your going and your coming. Is somebody saying amen? Is somebody saying amen? Whether you turn to the right or to the left, your ears will hear a voice. Somebody let me let you know this afternoon, you shall hear the voice of God directing you. An inner voice that will direct you. An inner voice that will take you from one state of life to the other state of life. By the power in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, you will not miss your way. Am I talking to somebody? Am I blessing anybody this afternoon? This afternoon, the sun will shine on you and you will never miss your road. Hear what the Bible says in Isaiah chapter 42 verse 16. He said, and I will bring the blind by a way that they knew not. There's a new road the Lord has opened for you. Amen and amen. There's a new door heaven has opened for you. He said, I will bring the blind by a way that they knew not. I will lead them to a path I will lead them in paths that they have not known. I see you moving on a new dimension. Hallelujah. <laughs> I see you moving from another dimension. Hallelujah. The Lord said, I will lead them in paths that they have not known. Oh my God. A new path. A new door. Somebody shout amen. Somebody say amen. A new door is being opened for you. A new door is being opened. A new path. God is making a new path. God is making a new path for you this month. Somebody say a new path. Somebody say a new path. Somebody shout a new path. Heaven is is making a new path for you in this month of August. Hear me. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. I receive this for you. I receive this for your family this afternoon. A new path. A new path. That is what the Bible says. The Lord is saying this in the book of life. The word of God says in Isaiah 42. Write it down. In Isaiah 42 verse 16. And I will bring the blind by a way that they knew not. I will lead them in paths that they have not known. They have not known. There is a new path the Lord is opening for you today. A new path you have not known before. Wow. Congratulations, child of God. 
Somebody said now nah, the Lord is opening up a new path for me. The Lord is leading me through a new path. I don't care where you have been passing through. I don't know the road you have been following. But God is opening a new path for you. Our Lord Jesus Christ is the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords, and the Alpha and the Omega. He's opening a new path for you this afternoon for the sake of your love, for the sake of this hour, for the sake of your devotion. God is opening a new path for you. Somebody shout a loud amen. Oh my God, somebody shout a loud amen. I see it happening and I believe because because God will direct you this month. Is somebody saying amen? Come on, say amen for your children. Say amen for your husband. Say amen for your father. Say amen for your mommy. Say amen for anyone who has asked you to pray for him or her. Pray that God will open a new path. Pray that heaven will open a new path. Pray that God will direct him. Pray that heaven will direct her. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. He said, I am opening a new path. I will make you pass in the road that you know not, in the way that you know not, in the way that you know not, in the way that you know not, in the path that you have never passed before. So shall it be. Somebody say, I receive. Somebody say, I receive. Somebody say, I receive it. I receive this grace. I receive this grace. I receive this blessing. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Oh my God. Hear what the Bible says. This word is for you. This afternoon. Hear what the Bible says. Hear what the word of God says. God has promised to do so much for you. I'm telling you. He says, For the Lord loves justice and does not forsake his saints. They are preserved forever by the power in the name of our Eucharistic Jesus. Behold your God. Behold the bread of life. Jesus. He said he will preserve you. God will preserve you. In this month of August, you shall be preserved. You and your entire family shall be preserved. Somebody say amen. Come on, say amen. You shall be preserved. You shall be preserved. The plans of the enemy to cut your life short is canceled. Hallelujah. The plan of Lucifer to cut your life short is cancelled. You shall be preserved. In the morning, you shall be preserved. In the afternoon, you shall be preserved. In the evening, you shall be preserved. Even at night, you shall be preserved. In the name of Jesus Christ. Fear not. The word of God says, fear not. Fear not. For they that be with us are more than they that be with them. That is what the Bible says. Fear not. Second Kings chapter 6 verse 16. Do not be afraid. No matter what, I see you ending this month with joy. Hallelujah. I see you ending this month with happiness. I see you ending this month with testimony. I see you ending this month with happiness. The devil cannot stop you. I see you ending this month with peace and joy. So shall it be. So shall it be. So shall it be in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Congratulation. 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 Amen and amen. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus, for this afternoon blessing. Thank you, Lord, for flooding our lives. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for blessing us. I want to end this afternoon section with this passage. Job chapter 11, verse 18 down to 19. Job chapter 11, verse 18 and 19. Take it, O child of God. He said, you will be secure because there is hope. You will look about you and take your rest in safety. You will lie down. With no one to make you afraid. Hey! And many will count on your favor. Hallelujah. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. I want to repeat this. Just listen attentively. The word of God is settled forever. This is for you. This is the word of God for you. You can take it down and go through it again after now. Job chapter 11, verse 18 and verse 19. Job chapter 11, verse 18 and verse 19. You will be secure. 
this month. You will be secure this month. Because there is hope. Somebody say there is hope. Somebody say there is hope. Say it again. There is hope. There is hope. There is hope. Oh my God. There is hope. I want somebody to type it. There is hope. <laughs> there is hope. There is hope. Great, great, great hope. There is hope. There is hope for you. There is hope for your family. There is hope for your children. There is hope for every member of your family. The devil cannot in any way stop you. I say, there is hope. Did you hear me? Hey, there is hope. Oh my God. Somebody say there is hope. Somebody say there is hope. Somebody shout it louder. Shout it louder. Say there is hope. Say there is hope. There is hope. There is hope for me. There is hope for you. There is hope for your brother. There is hope for your sister. There is hope for every member of your family. So shall it be. There is hope. There is hope for my sick brother. There is hope for my sick auntie. There is hope for my sick father. There is hope for all members of MDD Square. There is hope for all the sons and daughters of Father Dibia. There is hope for the children of God. For, there is hope for all those the Lord has given to me. And there is hope for you. Yes, there is hope. That is what the Bible says. That is what the Word of God says. That there is hope. There is hope for you. There is hope for your family. There is hope for your children. You will be secured because there is hope. You will look about you and take your rest in safety. You will lie down with no one to make you afraid. Hallelujah. You will lie down this month. No one will make you afraid. No power will make you afraid. No kingdom of darkness will make you afraid. Hallelujah. 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 You will lie down and with no one to make you afraid. And you know what? Many will count on your favor. Many will depend on you. Many will long. Many will long to, to enjoy the grace that is upon you. Many will long to experience the blessings around your altar. So shall it be. Now lift up your oil. I said I'm going to be blessing oil this afternoon. For security. Throughout this month. You will enjoy that security. Security. No power of the enemy can harm you. Is somebody saying amen? Ebere ukwe. Say amen. Amata amada so. Ebere odum. There is hope for my sick in-law. Yes. There is hope for your sick in-law. There is hope for Father Dibye. There is hope for you, Ohebu. There is hope for you, Wando Fabian. There is hope for you, Mata. There is hope for you. There is hope. There is hope. There is hope for all those who are sick. Do you hear me? There is hope. We have a mighty God. He's the great I am. With God, we are more than conquerors. We are overcomers. This month of August, there is hope for you. I see testimonies coming your way. I see favor coming your way. I say there is hope for you. Even though you are falling, I see you rising up. Even though you are in pain, I see you rising up. Even though they have written you up, I see you standing up. Because there is hope for you. Hear the word of God from this altar. There is hope for you. Whatever that is challenging you, may this altar swallow it. May this altar swallow that power that is tormenting you. I speak as your priest in the sanctuary of the Most High God that there is hope for you. This month has been declared our month of good news. It is our month of divine strength when God will empower you. No one can knock you down in the name of Jesus. You shall not be put to shame. The Bible says you shall not be afraid. You will sleep without anyone disturbing you. No power can disturb your life again. So receive this strength and be filled with the glory and the power of God. I congratulate you. I say happy new month to you. Happy new month to your family. Happy new month to your brothers and sisters. 
Happy new month to your relatives. Happy new month to all those who look up to you for help. Happy new month for all who believe that Jesus Christ is changing their situation. Are you listening to me? Are you with me, sons and daughters of God? Are you seeing the glory of God coming down upon you? Are you feeling the power of God all over you? Let the power of God begin to locate you now. I pray for divine strength upon you. I pray for divine power. Receive it now. There is hope for you. There is hope for you in this new month. There is hope for your siblings in this new month. There is hope for every member of your family in this new month. Let God arise. Let God bless you. And may you live to testify. Child of God, there is hope for you. Our God is blessing you today. Behold him. Yes, yes. Receive your healing. Rise and shine. Yes, yes. Behold him. Is it a go and the mozia? No, no, doom ta. Oh, no, doom. Name it to chim no be. Is a mo. Is a. Is a. Is a. Nadin do. Onye wani. Is it a gold and the mozia no modum ta? Oh, no doom. Neme to chim no be a war. The king of kings. Is it? Is it? Is it? Not in do. Is it? Behold him. Ask him to bless you. Drop your petitions. Tell him you want to be rich. Tell him you want to marry. Tell him you want to succeed. Tell him you need this, you need that. Onye wani. Is it a go? In the mozilla, wherever you are, receive the power. Oh no doom ta oh no doom ne me to chim no be a wo Eze 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 Nadin Dom So shall it be I bless your oil May this oil be for you the oil of strength May this oil be for you the oil of strength that this month of August, you will not lack strength. God will strengthen you. The King of Kings will strengthen your life, will strengthen your family. May this oil change your life. May this oil put something into you. And may you live to testify through the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Child of God, I congratulate you for this half hour we have spent with Jesus. And don't forget, this is just the beginning. By 3 p.m., we shall have another half hour. And during that time, I want you to be with water. We have just blessed the oil today for your strength. By 3 p.m., I want you to come with water. The Bible says, blood and water gushed out from the side of Jesus. That is the hour of mercy. So may this hour, this afternoon, brighten your life. May you receive strength from Jesus. And may this strength carry you all through this month. In the name of Jesus. I cover you with the blood of Jesus. I cover all that the Lord has done for you now with the blood of Jesus. I pray that God will bless your intentions that you are dropping now. I pray that God will answer your prayers. Somebody begin to say, thank you, Jesus, for this half hour. Half hour with the King of Kings. Half hour with the Alpha and the Omega. Blessed be the name of the Lord. See you again by 3 p.m. Congratulations. Don't forget, get your water along.
O sacrament most holy, O sacrament divine, all praise and all thanks given be every moment thine. O sacrament most holy, O sacrament divine, all praise and all thanks given be every moment thine. O sacrament most holy, O sacrament divine, all praise and all thanks given be every moment thine. Jesus, I love you. All I have is yours. Yours I am, yours I want to be. Do with me whatever you will. Jesus, I love you. All I have is yours. Yours I am and yours I want to be. Do with me whatever you will. Jesus, I love you. All I have is yours. Yours I am and yours I want to be. Do with me whatever you will. Thank you, Lord. Somebody say thank you, Jesus. May the Lord bless you all. May the Lord change your life. And may the Lord transform you. In Jesus' name. Amen. See you by 3 p.m. with your bottle of water. God bless you. Happy new month. Happy new month. Happy new month.